Hey guys, I'm making homemade goulash. This is the beginning process for browning up my brown turkey and I'll show you guys the next step. I added in some organic tomato and basil pasta sauce. Added in some squeeze in um, garlic paste. Add in the bag of organic mixed frozen vegetables. And I'm gonna add in the chickpea penne pasta. Some chickpea penne pasta as well. Okay hey guys, this is my pot of goulash. All done. Let me know if you like goulash and how do you make yours. This is homemade goulash that I made, guys. Stay tuned for the video. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Queen Ray, and I'm back with a home cooked meal today. I made some um, homemade goulash. Have y'all ever had goulash before or made it before? It's good. Um, what I put in mine was seasoned ground turkey, a uh, bag of frozen mixed vegetables, organic mixed vegetables, uh, some tomato and basil sauce, and some uh, penne noodles that I put in here, which was the chickpea noodles, uh, organic chickpea noodles that I put in here. And I seasoned it, put in some garlic paste and a little bit of sugar to cut that acid taste from the tomato sauce and seasonings, and that's it. So I'm gonna have this with you all today. Let me say my prayers. What are you all eating good today? And let me know in the comments, do you like goulash? Have you ever made it? It's really easy to make. Just throw in there what you got in your freezer. I didn't have any bell peppers or onions. I had a bell pepper that went bad, so I threw it away. So I didn't have any onions, but I would have added that in here too if I had some bell peppers and onions. Give y'all a bite. good and you can have bread with this if you want it but i didn't want any bread with it because i got um pasta in here but you can have it with some sourdough bread garlic bread or whatever now somebody may ask me how are the chickpea noodles this is my first time having chickpea noodles um they're okay they're kind of like, what's the consistency of them? Um, they're different from pasta noodles. They taste different from regular pasta noodles. Yeah. They're okay. I don't know if I rebound them again, but I want to try them. And they're pretty good. I got them because they got a lot of protein in them, so they got 19 grams of protein in them. This goulash came out really good. And everybody makes their goulash different ways. Some people put uh, macaroni noodles in it, elbow noodles, spaghetti. rice people use beef or ground chicken i use ground turkey with mine but it's all about putting there what you got in the freezer available that you want to use up make a good quick easy delicious meal I could have put some fresh um, garlic in here too, but I had some garlic, but I didn't feel like chopping it up. 
So let's use some of that uh, organic garlic paste. And I put some um, sulfury, uh, tap the brown seasoning here, the sunshine seasoning, some garlic powder, onion powder, add a little chili seasoning here, some crushed red pepper flakes, oregano, Italian seasoning, and uh, the uh, I think I said garlic powder and onion powder. And I'll put a little clip in the beginning how I made it, which took no time to make. I didn't use the um, whole box of noodles. I use like half the box. So, I don't know if they'll eat it in or not, but this will last, if they don't want any, this will last for a couple days. I made a pot of it. So I eat off this for two or three days. But it's good though. By tomorrow, it'll be even better than today. Cause all them seasons have been and went through it. I was supposed to make this yesterday, but I didn't cook it yesterday, so I'm like, let me go ahead and whip this up really fast. It's good though. Sometimes those fast, quick meals you cook, they come out really tasting really good. The ones you don't hardly put no effort into. So are y'all having a good summer so far? I hope so. It's not going to be a long video. I just want to come on and have my dinner with you all. And show you all my goulash that I had cooked. And to um, ask you guys, have you ever made it? And do you like it? Thank you to everyone who watched my previous uploads. Who like, comment, and share. Welcome to all the new supporters. Hey y'all, hey to all my old supportive family and friends. I appreciate each and every one of you. For taking the time to watch my videos, to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thank you all for all your kind comments. And for watching my videos to the end much appreciated i think i'm almost to the uh watch time hours where i can get monetized on youtube so i'm trying to get monetized i would like to earn a coin from my videos so that'll be great We all could use an extra coin here and there. Shout out to my friend Sticks and Charles. Sticks and Charge Charles. He um just got mine's has on his channel, so congratulations to him. Oh, excuse me. Hey Charles. Hope you're having a great day. So y'all go over and check out his channel, Sticks in Charge. Charles, he has great content. He does a variety of content on his channel. Y'all go check him out. And check out uh, my good sis, Dee Dee.
she's an awesome supporter. Alicia Southern Crew, Candy, who Vlog Life, and Slim Shell, Frank G, um, Forever Mimi. Y'all check out their channels. There's a lot of people that I watch on YouTube. And I always uh, share their videos on my community posts. Yep, so y'all check them out. When y'all make pasta dishes or use stuff with um, tomato sauce in it or spaghetti sauce, do y'all add sugar to cut that acidity taste? The sugar helps. This was good. I enjoyed it. So don't forget to let me know down in the comments, guys, what you all eating good today. And if you all have ever made goulash, do you like goulash? And what do you put in yours when you make it? Maybe I'll try your recipe next time. And uh, have a good day. And don't you keep God first. Don't forget to like. Like the video, guys. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Y'all be blessed. Bye, guys.